Welcome, I am Dirty Denman, and today we're going to be doing X and Y Nuzlocke Part 4. I think we gotta go this way, actually. First double battle. People say we're like two peas in a pod. They say we're two halves of a hole. <coughs> Twins, faith, and joy. Yep, plus on mining. <laughs> Skippy's about ready to level up, so that's good. Level 15. Good job, Skippy. Jimmy grew to level 15 too. And Sheldo did also. After we get done with this battle, I'll show you where they're all at. Helping hand ain't gonna work anymore, buddy. You don't have a helper. <laughs> Dang. Skippy grew, grew again. Ash Brownie grew to level 14. Nice. Heck yeah. <sighs> 352, nice. Oh, shoot, cutscene. My goodness, Pokemon hordes are certainly intense. Yeah, they're just like a dance team made up of Pokemon, aren't they? Oh, Tiamro, do you ever think about anything besides dancing? Nope. Even during Pokemon battles, I'm always checking out their moves. And then my feet start moving too. I can't even help it, you know. Like Swords Dance. I love it. I guess that's why I can never win. <clears throat> oh, hey, it's Dirty Demon. Do you, your Pokemon know any sweet moves? Show me in a battle. Okay. I guess I only got one. What the heck you been doing? <laughs> Alright, since that's water type, we're going to switch to... Hash Brownie. He's got Scratch, Fury, Fury Swipes, Vine Whip, and Lick. So we're going to do a little Vine Whip action. Half. Nice. Vice Grip. Oh. That's kind of scary. KO, buddy. It's the Fire Grew to 21. The next gym is level 24, so. And I'm probably gonna wanna level up 
Squirtle a little bit because I didn't do any off camera grinding. So I'll have to do that before we get to the gym. I was born to dance. I won't ever stop. Not with these mo moves like this. That's indeed a perfect dream for you, Tamo. I guess I should show just as much dedication to my dreams completing the Pokedex then. It's a good to be serious about some things. Oh, Dirty Diamond, do take this honey, won't you? Thank you. You see, using honey will encourage Pokemon hordes to appear. So if you're going to challenge a whole horde, you might want to use moves that can hit multiple targets. Yes, but if you get a horde that has a shiny, you don't want to do that because then you're going to kill the shiny. And we don't want to kill the shiny. Okay, um... Okay. Well, Mr. Fire's got full HP, so we probably could take this trend around no problem. Unless he's got some good, old, good water typing. I haven't been able to sleep very well for days. I don't know if I'm up for a battle. Kadabra. Ooh, this could be bad, to be honest. Flame charge. Oh. Please. Ooh, confusion. That's not too bad. Yeah. I hope we get to a city soon so I can heal my Pokemon. Jimmy grew to level 16. Flail? Mm -hmm. Let's see here. Um, growl. Yep. Double slap. Um, foresight. That's, that's kind of a pointless move in my opinion. I knew it. I really should have just gone get some. Gotta get some sleep. <clears throat> seven eighty for winning. Damn that. Dang that little kid had seven hundred eighty. Wow. Woo. Come on, pick it up. Super potion. I'll take it. Now we gotta go all the way around again. Mm. Get out of my way, people. <laughs> what? Oh, I was gonna say, what the heck? You don't want battle. Let's pr let me practice against you. Okay. What do you got? Bumblebee. Huh. I think we picked up one of those from one of the roots. So if one of our Pokemon do pass away, then... We have that ace in the hole. <laughs> But our bundle B will be better than that thing. Skiddo. Hey, that's going to be four times a week. Or at least two times. K.O. <laughs> Sheldo level 13 bubble. Um, yeah, get some squirtle, some bubble. Do 
The rules of a Pokemon battle are simple. You see, rule one battle, rule two win. Well, you're going to break rule two then, buddy. Because uh, you only got one Pokemon. And it's a Doduo. <laughs> I do love the move try attack for the, you know, the, the three-headed bird. The... Skippy grew to 17. Rowland. Um, target is blown away and different Pokemon is dragged out. That could be good for gym battles, actually. Let's go Sand Attack. Like, you could pull their ace out a little quicker. Hash Brownie grew to level 15. <laughs> Home claws, uh, that's a pointless one. I don't think anybody uses home claws. As long as I'm with my Pokemon, I don't meet all sorts of people around the world and trade and battle with them. Well, that's what Wonder Trade's for, buddy. Badoof. We're fighting against the God Pack here. Anish, um, yeah. <laughs> Anish is not really going to stand a chance against Flame Charge. Twenty-two, nice. Fire spin. Hmm. Get rid of tail whip for that. Probably won't ever use it, but it's better than tail whip. It's all thanks to my Bidoof that I got to meet you. That's got to be good for something. Yeah. You had to give away 600 bucks. <laughs> Which I guess is good for me. Oh, there's an item up there. We got to go grab that. X attack. Okay. I know most YouTubers don't battle everybody, but I like to battle everyone because I like money. Because you never know when you're going to need some potions or Pokeballs or, you know, whatever. 
Plus, we need some levels for Squirtle anyways. Or, yeah. Mini Assassin grew to 16. Actually, that reminds me, how far is Squirtle off? See, we got Mr. Fire at 22, Skippy at 17, Jimmy at 16, Ash Brownie at 15, Mini Assassin at 16, Sheldo at 13. He needs 20 to level up, so he'll be leveled up pretty soon. He's got Tackle, Bubble, Water Gun, Withdraw. But if... The second gym is 24. I really don't want to bring him in that low because he's going to get smoked. Chodo grew to 14. Okay. Let's switch him into the front while we beat this kid. Um, I want to know why I always wear shorts when I walk through the tall grass. <laughs> Okay, well that was not a good decision. Well, with him being in the front, he'll get more experience though, so... Yeah, so hopefully... Yeah, that would have been super bad because water doesn't do anything to begin with, so that would be like no damage whatsoever. <laughs> yeah, see, he got 162 just like Brakeson did. Okay, yeah. Jimmy's evolving. Nice. Fletch and Dirt Jimmy. Nice. I'm so proud of Jimmy. Ember? Oh yeah, Jimmy, you can get Ember. 35 and Hello, clip received. Thank you for using the Holocaster. Lissandre Labs developed the Holocaster to make lives of Pokemon trainers richer, fuller, and more convenient. We hope you continue to enjoy the fine services this device provides. Okay, whatever. It's about that time again, huh? That lazy lug will be back soon. Oh, I forgot. Uh, 
you there? Are you seriously going to come all the way to Camper Town and leave without even visiting the Shabu Castle? You're missing out. Half the joy in life. Well, maybe not a quarter. Hmm, that's probably overblowing it to 1%. You're missing out at least 1%. Well, okay, if you want me to look at it, then I will. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hi, Dirty Denman. An acquaintance of yours, two visitors to Shabano Castle. I can't remember the last time we were so busy. The Castle Chateau, if you will, was a manor house of the noble family. It may be a Little rundown, but that's because there's history to this place. During the history, the owners of this castle gave a lot of their stuff to everyone. That's why it feels so empty at the end. That's it? Don't you have anything related to Mega Evolution? That's it. What in the world is Mega Evolution? Dot, dot, dot. Sir, it's back again. Is it already that time of year already? Well, there's nothing I can do about that for now. I need to go to Route 7, but please take your time and have a look around. Okay, thank you. Goodbye. I wonder what that was about. Why don't we go to Route 7 too? Okie dokie. Well, first of all, we gotta check this castle out. I don't know if there's anything cool in here, but we're gonna check it out anyways. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, there's a nice bed in here. But, I don't think there's really anything cool. So we... Yeah, we go to Route 7, I guess. I thought there was a gym, but maybe not. Oh, shoot, it's a new route. Dirty Demon, they say that they're going this way. Okay, well, um... Okay... I think this is where they do the berries. Hey miss, this way, this way. You, I know this is an unexpressed request, but can you care, take care of my berry field? Berries are great, one berry can produce more berries, and then you got a lots of berries. Yeah, I'll do it. Oh great, what's your name? Oh, your name's Dirty Denman. Thank you, Dirty Denman. Hooray, that's great, Grandpa. I must teach you how to take care of the fields. Okay, plant a berry in the soft soil. Check the soil you want to plant the berry in, and you choose the berry from your bag. I shall give you some berries to plant. So now we're farmers, <laughs> which is cool. I love, I love farming in games, because it's always good to get more stuff. The loot. Peachy berries. I like those. Sprinkle it though. That's, that's your uh, good old watering can. It looks like a uh, little tad. If I remember correctly. I'm so relieved. My back has been killing me lately. I've been doing too much gardening. Alright grandpa. Head out. I live in the house at the corner of the field. Okie dokie. Well, how many berries did they give us here? Because I'm going to plant them all. Okay, we got one. Two. Or uno, dos. Trace or three Quattro
or four. One, one, two, uno, dos, tres, cuatro. And then we got Cinco for five. And since this is a different type of berry, I'm going to go down this field. One, two. Yeah, I don't like to get my berries mixed up. I'm sorry if this is a bit boring, but I like to do the boring things in games. Oops, oops. We're going to plant the last one, then water all of them. <clears throat> yes, we like to water it. See, it's like a low tad. It's pretty cute. I like it. Holy cow, how much water do we need? Dang. You water the soil, now it's nice and moist. Well, that's the way plants should be, so that's good. Okay, that's good enough. Good enough. So when we come back here, hopefully these berries are ready to go. I forgot how long they take, actually, to be honest with you, but I can look that up in a little bit here. We got four more to go. Make that three more to go. This berry music is pretty cool, though. Alright, so we'll probably get our Route 7 encounter, and then I'll call it a video. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, Snorlax. So we gotta go get the flute. So I guess I can't get my Route 7 encounter. That kinda sucks. Use the pokey flute. Oh wait. Do you even have it anymore? Nope, I handed it over. Or you could say it was taken by the owner of the palace. What? Huh? A pokey flute? Basically, the Poke Flute is what we need to wake up Snorlax. But the Poke Flute is currently at the Perfume Palace. And that's it. All we need to do is go get it then. Well, yeah. Come on, Dirty Landman, let's go. The Perfume Palace is on Route 6. And maybe at that place, we might learn something about Mega Evolution. Well, that's true. They could teach us some stuff. So now we're going to go to Route 6. I'm going to get that encounter. So we're going to get in. Get in here and grab this. And we still got Squirtle in the front. Okay, yep. So we're going to battle. Uh, actually, uh. Yeah, yeah, let's battle this guy. Because we can battle. Nope, okay. Um. Uh, 
Huh, okay. I actually forgot how to get in there. But, we're gonna call this a video. I'll leave it off right here. Thank you for watching. This has been Dirty Denman. Subscribe to the Denman Army. Like and comment. Peace out.